Illinois COVID-19 hospital admissions have increased for four straight weeks. The Illinois Department of Public Health continues to urge people to get up-to-date COVID-19 and flu vaccines to prevent serious illnesses. Capitol Bureau Chief Mike Militich is live in Springfield tonight with the latest. Good evening, Mike. Daniel, good evening. There are currently 1,800 people hospitalized for COVID-19 in Illinois, which is the highest IDPH has reported since February of 2022. Dr. Samir Vohra says immunocompromised people, adults over 65, and young children are most vulnerable to COVID-19 hospitalization right now. He suggests taking a COVID-19 test before seeing family or friends for this holiday weekend. If you have symptoms and test positive for COVID, Vohra says you should stay home and contact a health care provider as soon as possible in order to figure out the best treatment. He stressed that people should also take care of themselves and their loved ones so they don't end up needing to spend time in the ICU. Intensive care unit bed availability, so sort of hovering down that, t below that 20% threshold across the state that makes us feel better when we're above 20%. Right now at 15%, we imagine that that number, that availability is only gonna shrink Fora says people should wash their hands properly and have good ventilation if they host family members and friends over the holiday. He also stressed that people need to wear masks again in order to prevent the spread of COVID-19. For now, reporting live in Springfield, Mike Miltich, WGM News.